I wish, I don't just want to be out here having the table selling oils. Listen, I want to be, I want to have, I want to be in the mall. And have like a, a little booth in the mall. From a booth, have a store in the mall. From a store, if business expand to actual, cor- actual, actual warehouse. Warehouse, corporation. And have the warehouse filled with, with, with drums of oils. If you don't know what drums is, drums is 25 pounds per, per cent. Drums of oils. Have ten thousands have thousands and thousands of bundles of incense that I'm shipping out wholesale. 30 pounds of, of, of oils being shipped out a day wholesale. 20 gallons of oils being shipped out a day wholesale. You got to speak it into existence, man. But you can't talk like this around average people. You can't. Average guys that sell oils, you can't talk like this because they don't understand you. Talk to somebody like myself who understand you, and I guarantee you, you're going to see some results. You got to speak it into existence. That's the way it works. You got to, man, you got to, you got to vision it. Look what my man's just say. I want to have lots of cow. I want to have land. You got to talk like that, man. In order for you to talk, in order for you to be able to continuously talk like that, you have to be around people who constantly talk like that, like your boy Professor Smell Good. You see what I'm saying? That will inspire you, inspire you to keep moving with this and to think more corporate minded with the oils. No, you know, go from jeans, selling oils with jeans on, to slacks. I go to work with slacks on, no jeans. From Air Force Ones or Jordans to selling oils with casual shoes on. Or boots. You know, casual boots. Because, you know, me being a grocery store, you know, the, the door opening, you know, I have to wear boots because it's, it, get, it get cold in Detroit. You know, but slacks from uh, a t-shirt that got a $100 bill on it saying, uh, let's get money to... Um, a dress shirt, a button up dress shirt from, you know, a dress shirt with a tie and a vest, okay? In the, in the, in the case of me, I, I actually come to work with my lab coat on. And I actually did a test. I went to my shop. I was still dressed casual. I went there without the lab coat. And you know what? They said, we almost didn't even notice you. I said, why is that? They said, because you ain't got the lab coat on. It became so much a part of me that it... It didn't even look like me without it. That's what I'm saying. That's a really good thing for them to actually say that. That let me know I'm doing something right. You have to actually have an attire in which you come to work. So people can know who you work for. I remember a couple, uh, like two years ago, me and a brother named Khalifa, uh, the alchemist. They call him the alchemist, okay, here in Detroit. I was the one that got him into the oil game. Uh, he's still selling oil still to this day. He's doing good. He's doing pretty good with it too. Um, but me and him, we developed something that is called uh, the Sunnah uh, the Sunnah Aroma Academy Telelink, in which in which I would get uh, very I would I would get very successful people with the oils on a telelink, so they can tell us what we need to do to take this oil game to the next level. So it was, uh, at this time, it was, uh, I think it was me, Brother Khalifa, and Ismail from Extravagant Fragrance. We was all on there. Um, and it's, it's a guy, uh, it's a guy who, I don't want to say his name, but it's a guy from Atlanta. He sells oils, and he's a millionaire. He told me that he makes a million dollars a year. And so we asked him, I asked him, I said, what do, what do we need to do to take this oil game to the next level? And he said to me, he said, what do you have on your chest? Now, I think this, this is probably almost, yeah, just about two years ago. He said, what do you have on your chest? I said, what do you mean? He said, do you have the name of your business on your clothing so people can know who you work for? And I said, mmm. I said, wow. Deep. Very deep. And so from there on, I actually incorporated the lab coat. I incorporated the lab coat, and I will actually get the lab coat, and I will put my logo on my lab coat. You know what I'm saying? Before then, I would come to work with my lab coat on, but I never thought about just putting Professor Smellgood on until he said that. Actually, no, 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 I'm sorry.